Okay, here's another one of these annoying things that we, we're going to demo with. Another capitalist junket. Let's see if we can make it look any interesting anyway. Even though it's shit. Don't know how this is going to look. Going to make it a negative positive for this. All right, let's see what we have. We have here Woolworths Fresh, but we're not interested in the fresh bit. We've got this left out that's stuck in here, Health and Beauty. Again, another fucking dumbass Health and Beauty thing to deal with in this demo set. Um, I really don't understand why they call it beauty. You know, honestly, it's not beautiful. I just can't see why it's called beautiful beauty where it's it's artificial. I'm just going to use my camera hand just there on the cat on the button. But you just they just call it beauty. It's all about money making. People are gullible. People think they're ugly unless they wear their makeup or take their beauty, do their beauty routine. It's not beauty. Beauty is from within, folks, not fucking what's on the outside. Yes, it could be beautiful on the outside, but it comes naturally. It's not something that you... And then even if you haven't got beauty on the outside, what's from within can radiate out, and you can look more beautiful uh, without the treatments, you know, without the shit. No, oh, it's awful. Oh, that bloody purple. <laughs> but basically... Beauty is from within, it's not fucking from the outside in. It's really awful that people are so insecure about themselves that they feel they must spend truckloads of money beautifying themselves. Well, they think they're beautifying themselves, but the fact of the matter is, it's usually the opposite. It looks ugly. It's not real. How can it be beautiful if it's not real? I'm wondering if we're going to just do this as a positive. We're going to do it again. But basically, I just don't understand the mentality behind beauty. It's called beauty, but that's a mis misnamed. Misnamer. In other words, a, a mistaken name. Or incorrect name, should I say, Mesnoma. And they call it they call it beauty. I don't understand beauty, as as in this makeup shit. Honestly, I don't understand it. I don't understand how people, especially women, want to fuck up, fuck around with their looks just to satisfy what society puts upon them the pressure the peer group pressure like at high school people should learn to be themselves and accept themselves as they are instead of feeling the pressure to be someone else or something else even if it's fake you know and people indeed get boob jobs you know fake fake boobs 
just so they can feel more feminine or womanly when they can just be themselves. If they're flat chested, they should consider it an asset. I wish I was flat chested sometimes, and I have done. So, but basically, beauty is something that comes from, should come from within, not, not be something, I don't know, I really struggle to understand the mentality of beauty of how I don't understand how it works folks how most seems like most women fall for all this hard sell just so they can you know they, they think they're ugly when really they just have to be themselves instead of being fucking a parody because these money fucking cosmetic companies really thrive on on feeling on people feeling insecure because then they sell more product for those gullible people usually women and it's such a popular topic so many women usually women uh, like to talk about it and it's a hot topic online it's a hot topic online they always keep talking about it and making often making um, videos about the beauty about beauty now that looks interesting I think we could stretch it maybe um, maybe not but basically it's beauty is not something that should be something that is capitalist it should be something that's that's you you got to be yourself you got to fucking be yourself and just not just shake off this shit. This is shit. It's not beauty. It's money making. Money, money rotting. I just, I don't understand it, folks. Uh, I've had cosmetic people tr in shopping malls trying to sell me their product, forcing it down my throat without my, against my will. And I just say, look, I don't want shit on my face. Because um, I don't like wearing stuff. I don't like, I, to be honest, folks, I don't like having cream or stuff on my face, incidentally. So I'm a person who hates the feeling of cream, of something slippery and something oily, or something that feels slippery and oily. On my skin I just don't like it and these beauty people who are obviously lowly salespeople and they're obviously desperate to make a profit but basically they try to force it down your down my throat try to tell me oh it's it's yeah so look I can't afford this shit I'm not rich and I said no no you don't have to you know it's a free sample I don't want the fucking sample. I don't want to put it on my face. I hate it. I hate having fucking shit on my face, I said to, in so many words, to one beauty care worker. And she said, oh, no, it's not you. It's like, fuck off. No, I don't want it. Don't you know the meaning of fucking no? I didn't say that. But basically, I've had it happen at least three times. And one was a male, and he got me to have my fingernails buffed. And I didn't like it. You know, I don't want it. I'm not into that shit. I don't want my nails buffed. I don't want my fucking... I don't want cream on my face. Or shit on my face, as I called it. I don't want that stuff on me. I want to just be me. Leave me alone, bitches. Go fuck your money. Go fuck your cosmetics. I don't want your fucking cosmetics. I didn't say that. I wish I had have gone off into a tirade like that just to fucking show them that they fucking don't tell me what to do with my body. So, yeah, I'm telling you, folks, don't listen to those bitches. You've got to stand up for your rights to be yourself, to be who you want to be, not what other people, no fucking peer group pressure from anyone. see if this looks any good. That purple does look nice and I like that slightly 
funny looking movement there. Uh, I don't know if it's going to look any good, but it looks okay. Considering it's from a piece of shit. Let's see how we go. But you know, you've got to be yourselves, folks. And to me, being myself means no makeup. The only thing, the closest thing to beauty that I would come is just to have my hair removed on my legs or my bikini line. That's the only place where I'll permit cosmetic type stuff. But even then, you know, you shouldn't have to feel pressurised even to do that. Uh, that's the only thing I would like done. Um, but that's it. Nothing else. I don't want all the other shit. Let's see how we go with the final part of this demo. Yeah, well, you get the feeling those um, beauty care um, salespeople, real hard sellers of these products, yeah, they just don't seem to take, they don't seem to know the meaning of no for an answer. But then they are probably poor themselves and they probably don't have a proper job and they're probably commission workers. But still, it, it does, it's intrusive when they just try to shove the sample in your fucking face. Um, two of these workers were in Chatswood. One was in, in um, Westfield and the other one was in Chatswood Chase. And I went to Brisbane and I don't know the name of the store. It was in Brizzy. So there are three of them and they're forcing their fucking wares upon me. Anyway, that looks interesting. I think now we can call this beauty rant over.